price. So today I show you Fiat Brava, 1.6 diesel, lots of power car, and I think very nice car. Uh, not popular in this country. Uh, we make a few modifications, of course, like the wheels was pop out. Too dark to see the spacers, but front is the 20, uh, 20 millimeter spacers, rear is torchy. So that's handy. All right, so it looks like diesel engine. Yeah, true, diesel engine. Uh, and then we have to replace the, the oil, oil filter. So the cap inside is here. Dip, dipstick we have here. Just the, just the oil filter is in really bad place because it's there. So we have to up the car, remove the uh, wheel, remove the cover, and then we will be see the uh, oil filter. All right. Not much left. First, we have to remove this cover because the filter is there. Then we remove it there. this corner, we can see place of the filter and we can see the oil cap removal. But for me, this panel must be out as well. Thirteen size of the cap. The cap is like uh, Opel Insignia uh, is with hole, so easy make the mess. Okay, oil is leaking, uh, dropping down, time to remove it, the oil filter cap, it's the 32 spanner and a little flight. Do step by step. See what I'm talking about? You just little open, you have the hole here, and the oil is pissing from this place. So careful. Try make some cover, but I know this is nothing perfect. Still, we'll be piecing the oil everywhere, but we have no choice. We have to play like that. the oil beginning leaking from from the small tube so if you if you can you can put some some pipe there but that's anyway it will be everything for that's not a good idea because that's leaking everywhere yeah no 
out very well, but I have to wash after. place. All right, so we have the filter here, so we just pop out like that and we replace just the inner. Of course, best idea is compare the old one with the new one. And very well is the wash inside and after that fit the new one. ready to go. So, new filter going in. Yeah, and then spawn. Okay, so almost done. Be gently because this is only twenty five Newton meters. Wash after. So time put back the cover. Okay, so cover is in. If you're looking for the air filter, actually it's here. This is the tube filter fitted on the bottom. Okay guys, so another cover is in. Yeah. So start the engine. Run a few seconds and check the oil. If the oil is like that, is like actually maximum here. We have the oil almost two millimeters before. I left like that. That's great. Okay, okay. Time to close the bonnets. Ah, cover. Take care. All right, so the oil service is done. Don't forget, of course, add the oil here. Uh, that was around 4.8, but try fill the 4.6 and check the dipstick. Then start the car and check again, and of course, add to the maximum. Uh, will be great if you leave the two millimeters be, be, uh, below minimum. That will be better for the DPF system because if the DPF system recognizes too high oil level, 
he will be stopped cleaning your DPF. So, all right, almost done. Just stick it on the window and go to roads. Thank you.